Hi, Brent Tech here. Where tech is made simple. The latest Windows 11 Patch Tuesday cumulative update KB5008215 is now available and started rolling out on the 14th of December 2021. And once this update is applied, that will now take your OS build in Windows 11 to 22,000.376, which is now the latest version and build now the stable version and build of the Windows 11 operating system. Now, just like I mentioned in my previous Windows 10 update video, there will be no C-release optional bug fix update rolling out at the end of this month due to the holidays season, Microsoft says. So those will continue at the end of January next year, 2022 uh, for Windows 11 and also Windows 10. Now, if you'd like to see if you have this latest security update for Windows 11, as always, just head over to your settings menu, Windows Update. And these Patch Tuesday cumulative updates are compulsory mandatory updates, as many of you know. So they will be downloaded and installed automatically onto your device. And then you'll just have to restart your device to apply the update. And once that's done, cumulative update for Windows 11 KB5008215, you can find that under quality updates in your update history. Now, as mentioned in my previous Windows 10 video, just like um, Windows 10, uh, Microsoft says that this is a security update, um, which updates security for your Windows operating system and contains miscellaneous security improvements uh, to the OS functionality. No additional issues were documented for this release. And if we just head over to the um, security update guide for this uh, update that have just had, this security update that has just rolled out, it won't just contain security updates to Windows 11 and Windows 10. It will contain numerous security updates and fixes for um, the different Microsoft products that are available. And there are too many to mention in this video as this list goes on forever. But um, Windows 10 and 11 will receive more or less the same security updates. And then also there will be numerous other updates for the other Microsoft products that are currently available as well. Now, on a side note, just like I mentioned in my previous Windows 10 video, if you didn't install the optional, up, uh, optional bug fix update, which rolled out near the end of November for Windows 11, KB5007262, which included numerous bug fixes which and i'll just mention some of those quickly that had bug fixes for fonts the internet explorer file explorer audio and also microsoft installer issues if you didn't install this optional bug fix update all those fixes will be carried over into this compulsory security update and if you did install the optional update then this latest update 5008215 will just be purely a security update and then also um KB5007262, if you didn't install it, as many of you know by now, that also included the new emoji panel which rolled out. And if you didn't install that optional update, you will now also have the new emoji Fluent Design um, uh, with this latest update, KB5008215. And I will leave a link to the optional update video I posted at the end of November, which you can go check out if you'd like to know more about those bug fixes and then also this latest update 5008215 also includes quality improvements to the servicing stack which is the component that installs windows updates and for whatever reason um, the update is battling or you're having issues installing the update through the windows update process in windows 11 you can also always head over to the microsoft update catalog online where you can go download and install the update um, manually which normally helps if you are having issues installing the update through windows update so kb5008215 is the latest patch tuesday cumulative update security update rolling out now for the windows 11 operating system so i hope you found this video useful once again thanks for watching and i will see you in the next one